Buongiorno, friends. I'm speaking here from my friend Poverty's home, uh, Aruna, Italy. Let's settle in with our slow, deep breath. Om Tatsa. Om Shanti. This is episode number 230, entitled, Bet You Can't Eat Just One. And we're on the 21st verse of the fifth chapter. I'll read it to you. <clears throat> Discovering the bliss that arises from the self, they no longer yearn for pleasures from the outside. Absorbed in Brahman, they dwell in inexhaustible joy. <clears throat> Most of us would like to be truly happy. Wherever we get a taste of that, we naturally latch on to that. The only way we're going to be able to get let go of what he calls the yearning for pleasure from the outside is if we can derive more pleasure from somewhere else. We can try to convince ourselves that what we find pleasurable from the outside is not really so great after all. I haven't found great results from this approach. The advertising people who came up with that you can't eat just one for Lay's potato chips knew what they were talking about. In my experience, the yearning that Sri Krishna talks about will only subside if the mind is given something even better. My guru never asked us to give up anything. If we think that something is enjoyable, enjoy it. Enjoy it consciously. He told us that as we're sincere and steady in our quest to uncover the spirit, our system gets more refined. And as our system gets more refined, we may find that uh, we're not able to squeeze the same amount of pleasure out of things that we used to. And we may find that we occasionally are tasting something very sweet and delicious that's not coming from an outside source. And this results in a, a saner, less addictive relationship with the pleasures of the world. For reflection, until we're absorbed in Brahman and dwelling in this inexhaustible joy that Krishna talks about, what are we supposed to do to deal with the yearning and attachment to the pleasures from the outside? You may feel that you have faith that there's something that's much greater than anything that can, we can enjoy here. But ask yourself, how much effort, how much self-denial should I go through as I'm waiting to discover that? Thanks for joining. See you soon. Om Shanti. Shanti. Shanti.